the number one restaurant chosen by people who come to Japan. Saizeria. Samurai Junjiro Channel. Hi, I'm Samurai Junjiro, born and raised in Japan. In this video, I'm going to introduce you to Saizeria, an Italian restaurant that originated in Japan. Saizeria is so popular that it has been ranked number one on the list of restaurants chosen by people who come to Japan. I'll announce the total amount at the end, so please stay tuned. Now, let's get started. We are at Saizeria. I've actually introduced Saizeria once before. But it was right after I launched my YouTube channel, so I was terrible at filming and editing. This time, I'm going to present it in a more delicious way than any other channel. Once we are seated, let's order our food. Let's start with the drinks. I decided on beer and white wine. Alcohol is also very cheap in Saizeria. Cheers! Now, let's order our food. Let's start with the salad. I decided on the Caesar salad with spicy chicken. The dressing with mayonnaise and ketchup has the same taste for 40 years. It's topped with lots of ground Moravia cheese, which has a strong cheese flavor. The sour dressing and cheese go great together. There are also croutons and corn in this dish, so you can enjoy a variety of textures. The juicy chicken has just the right amount of spice. It's a great meal at a great price. Next is a dish of beef and pork offal, mozu, stewed in tomato sauce. I can smell the good aroma of olive oil. The mozu is cooked for a long time and it's so tender it melts in your mouth. It's sour and goes great with wine. The texture of the white beans is also a nice accent. If you put it in bread and eat it, it would be even more delicious. Next, let's order some hot food on the iron plate. Let's start with the chicken. It's a boiling thigh that's been dipped in spicy sauce and grilled. It's the hottest dish in Saizeria. The meat is juicy and very tender. It's spicier than expected, but the taste is addictive. Let's try it with cheese sauce. The sauce is made with mayonnaise and olive oil and it's very creamy. It makes spicy chicken mild. I can't believe it's so good and under $6. Next, let's try the mussels. They are baked with a vegetable paste mixed with olive oil. They are big, thick mussels. The aroma of garlic is irresistible. Let's eat it with a soy sauce flavored sauce. The mussels are plump and sweet. The crunchiness of the vegetables is a nice accent. The quality of the food is as good as it gets in a fancy Italian restaurant. All of the food is delicious, so I can't stop drinking. Even if you eat this much, the price is still very reasonable. Let's try some of the recommended dishes. Let's start with the most popular dish. It's a baked doria with meat sauce and cream sauce on top of rice. It's incredibly cheap, isn't it? 
The cream sauce and meat sauce go great together. The rice is cooked with turmeric, which gives it a nice bitter taste. If you mix it well and eat it, it will be more delicious. I can't believe a dish this good is under three dollars. Let's try the next dish. This is cream spaghetti with shrimp. It also contains tomatoes and broccoli, so it's a lot of ingredients. I love the smell of black pepper. The pasta is chewy and cooked just right. The cream sauce with the sourness of the tomatoes goes well with it. The texture of the shrimp and broccoli is a nice accent. If you go to a fancy restaurant, you can expect to pay over two hundred dollars for this dish. Next is the dish I recommend the most. It's a rib steak cooked on a hot iron plate. You won't believe the price for a big steak, right? The balance of lean and fat is just right. The meat is very tender. It's juicy with just the right amount of fat on it. It's good enough as it is, but let's put some sauce on it. Let's add some vegetable paste seasoned with olive oil. The soy sauce flavored sauce makes it even better. The vegetable paste is refreshing. It's almost as good as a steak specialty restaurant. Finally, let's have dessert. It's tiramisu from Italy. I love the aroma of mascarpone and cocoa powder. It's great that dessert is also cheap. It has a fluffy and melty texture. It's creamy and smooth. The espresso-soaked sponge dough is so authentic. It's simple but delicious. Well, how much do you think it was to drink and eat so much? The answer is thirty-nine dollars and thirteen cents. Amazing price, right? Not only is it cheap, but it's really. Delicious! Please try it when you come to Japan. If there's a restaurant you'd like me to introduce, let me know in the comments. Well, that's it for today. See you in the next video.